Hello there, and welcome back to Last Day of Wonder Boy. Well, we're back here in Grim Soul Survival, uh, Grim Soul Fantasy Survival, whatever the hell the game's actually called. I just call it Grim Soul Survival. It's a lot easier. Anyways, guys, welcome back. Since we suffered, there's been an update in between. I tried to record a video. It didn't work well because I'm not powerful enough to kill this son of a gun. So, uh, unfortunately, that's scrap video. We did get the free chest, though, and I'll show that off. I have no plans for this video. Well, I had no idea what I was going to do for this video, but I really wanted to record a Grim Soul video for two reasons. One, it's been a while since I played, and two, you know, that's just kind of my channel's thing. And Grim Soul Survival, Tiny Space Program, and then Idle Games, you know. Uh, so yeah, plus, let's just try to get this over with. I, I got a lot... I got, a, I got a lot of idle games I need to play, alright? They've been doing pretty well recently. Anyway, so what I was going to say is, I want to see, I don't think I have enough energy for it. But I want to try to find out, out of the main four locations, these ones, one, two, three, four. Out of the main uh, four or one school locations. The reason I say main is because, yeah, there's like one there, there's one all the way over there. I want to find out which one is the best. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to each and we're going to loot a chest from each. And then that chest will determine which one is the best. So the chest that has the best loot at the end of the day is going to be, end up being the best chest. All right. So I'll have an entire point system. Uh, you see a skill book, which if you don't know what a skill book is, it's one of these things here. Uh, it gives you one of these skills, and I believe if you get multiple, it, like, upgrades them. So, yeah, a skill book is worth 10 points. Uh, other special items include, like, any rare items that are just super hard to find. Those are 5 points. And then any uh, soul shards, arts, those are 3 points. And then if I get a skull, skulls are cool, so those are worth 2 points. And everything else is just, uh, you know, just crap. Alright, we've arrived at our first location, and there's already a chest here. Okay, this is a good sign. There is a, quite a few enemies. What is what is this thing here? That is a de deer, and then that right there is a leaper. Okay, we can deal with the leaper. Hopefully, let's sneak up behind them, that way we make sure no other of the enemies. It's just me and you, and now it's just me. Okay, that's another leaper. Let's get that guy over there, because that guy is very likely to be a dam. Usually, you know, there's like a dam in uh, every... Guarding every chest. There we go. Ooh, we got a piece of claw. That's pretty good. Oh, no, just the wolf. All right, let's attract the wolf because I don't want to attract whatever the hell that is. Because that right there might be a dam. And I'm just trying to avoid dams right here. We're just here to see which location has the best loot. All right. Uh, okay. Ooh, this is pretty bad. I'll give them two points for that, because that's, uh, you know, that's a pretty good item right there that's a healable. But only two points, that's pretty weak. I forgot to bring my pickaxe so I can, you know, break. Where's the gravestone? I lost it. So I can break this thing, this gravestone. Disrespect the dead, honestly. It's, it's just the best thing you could do. Alright, we're here in the location now, so we have... God damn it, I really need... I should have brought a pickaxe, you know. So we're in the second Stonehill location. The uh, one that is slightly further away from our house, from my house. I don't know where you guys live. If you play Grim Soul, then uh, you probably live in the same location as me. Okay, we're just trying to avoid like every single enemy here. Our our only goal is to get to the chest. Jeez, I got a lot of hiccups. Okay, there's the chest. Okay, there's three enemies here. That's the dam. Damn it! <laughs> I'm hilarious. Comedy. All right. Let's keep up. This guy's... Jeez, this guy's still doing six damage despite the fact I'm fully armored. What the hell, dude? Alright. He didn't even drop cloth. What a jerk. Alright. That's another damn... This chest better be good. Or else I'm... Oh, goddammit. Okay, the weapon just broke. I should have probably brought another weapon. Okay, so I'm just gonna, like, eat all these berries. And, uh... No, I do not want to purchase. I got anything here? No, oh, I meant to take the stone axe, not not that. Oh, shoot, okay. We might have to leave these other mints behind. Oh, shoot, what the flip? Where did you come from? Oh, no, oh, no, I'm gonna throw up and die. This is the end. Oh, shoot, okay, come on. No, hurry up, start attacking now. That That's why you do not use berries as healables. Oh, no, I'm gonna die, I'm dying. 
Oh, oh, oh my god. I don't know how I'm still alive. Holy crap. Okay. So far, th this location gets a negative one points for attacking me with a dam. J Jesus. Holy crap. And then I have to fight this one. Oh, man. Okay, let's try to get a sneak attack on this guy. Got these berries first. And, uh, hot berries. Okay, those are the hot berries. We want holy berries, because hot berries... Oh, crap. Okay. That was my fault for not crouching. I can't blame anybody for that one. At least I'm doing 9 damage. You can't defeat me. I would not say that. I've died at least twice to these guys. Die, die, die. Okay, give me... At least he gave me some cloth. That's some string. I'll take that. I'm running a little bit low on the string. This chest better have been worth all the trouble I just went through. Oof, this. This is a pretty bad chest. It's better than the last one. This counts for, uh, this right here, that counts for one point, so that minus is their negative point. So they're tied because they got two because of that jar. No, I meant to take it all. So, so far, we have, uh, we have a draw. So hopefully the wooden locations are going to be better. The Merchant's Escort. I had completely forgotten about that one. This one sucks. This one's horrible. Don't do that one. Not unless if, like, you're fully armored. And, uh, I don't even think it's worth it. I don't even know what you get at the end, to be fair. I died before I got there. But, uh, you know, just don't do that. And if you're curious why, then go check out the video in the iCard on the top. Alright, we're in the first wood location. So now, we just gotta search for the chest and... There's probably some berry bushes, too. You know, we need- we kinda need some healables. I'll equip this, just in case if I get freaking harassed by another dam. Ooh, some more hawberries. We want hawberries. Hawberries make hawberry stew. And hawberry stew is a pretty good and cheap uh, healable. It's it's pretty resourceful overall. Okay, let's uh, crouch here. Don't do that weird drag thing, please. Okay. Yes, here's a chest. My instincts were right. Okay, I think... Okay, that's just a wolf. We can deal with a wolf. We'll probably have to fight four enemies for this chest. Let's try to keep it at four and uh, no higher. Okay, another wolf. Okay, these are at least easy enemies. This guy does four damage? Jeez. And my armor's about to break, because of course it is. Wolves aren't going to beg for mercy, dude. They can't talk. Okay, uh, Leaper, you come over here. There is nowhere to hide. Mm, I could hide behind that tree in the bag. In the grass. Are they good hiding spots? No. But there is hiding spots. Please don't be a damn. Oh, phew, it's just a leaper. Nice. I can smell your scent. Well, at least your nose works, dude. Meaning he does not have COVID. That's a good thing. Alright, let's just get to looting this now. How many points we got for this one? Oh, this one's bad. I'm giving you one point for the cloth. S meaning that this place, so far, is in last. I was not expecting, I was expecting, well, I'm going to take these, I was expecting this location to do better, only one point, I am being very disappointed currently, to be fair, I am only loading, uh, I am only doing one chest, maybe in the future when I'm more skilled and have more armor, or at least a steady supply of it, then you know, I could like redo this, but this time loot all the chests, have a better system. We could loot all the zones. You know what? These are this is these are some great videos idea. I should start writing these down. Alright, we're in the second wood location now. So you know, hopefully things don't go horrible here. And hopefully this chest is actually good. These have actually been I should stop saying actually this much, like actually. Um uh, But no, seriously, they're these chests have been horrible, like, I usually don't get this bad of chests, and of course I'm gonna get attacked by these guys. This is why I wanted to avoid, because my armor- No! How did my armor and weapon just break at the same time? I'm out, I'm out. Okay, this location's getting negative points already. I don't care if that was my fault, that's negative one point right there. Berries and even meat can be eaten raw, but it, yeah, it's a lot better prepared. Man, and now I wasted those. I guess I'll equip the torch, some gloves. Do I got a healable here? No. What about here? No, I got some soul. Ooh, I do got a cap, though. Not gonna cap. Yes. All right, here we go. All right, now we're gonna get our revenge here. These guys better be ready for it. Whoa. 
Okay, they're not gonna attack us. Of course, now I'm wasting this. <sighs> Whatever. I really don't want to be wasting this. this. Is like, can I equip this here? I can. Oh, that's convenient. That does mean I'm not gonna have healables equipped. But you know, that's fine. We can live without healables for a little. I'm gonna eat these berries though. That way, I'm at least fully healed. All right. Oh shoot, enemies there. Why is there so many enemies on the edge? Like, I, I expect them to be, like, in the center. The edge is supposed to be, like, the safe spot, you know? Mm, okay, where the hell is this chest? Someone explain to me where this chest is. That's that's a leaper. Oh, I found the chest. <gasps> that's a ritual circle. Hell yeah. Okay, we gotta sacrifice this damn here. Look at the amount of enemies here. I don't know if we're gonna be able to get that chest. No, the torch. Yes, 13 damage. It's not bad, actually. That's more than a hatchet. Ooh, yeah, no, that's some good damage right there. Take that. Oh, I can actually... <gasps> I can loot those areas. That's amazing. I did... I'm going to loot a ritual circle? Holy crap, that's... I don't think I can put my excitement into words. Like, holy crap. Please, nothing harass me. Okay, of course the sleepers can notice me. Oh, that's a damn. That's a damn. And now I have to vomit. No, 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 no. This game. This. This game. Oh. Okay. Anyways, guys, I think this is a good place to end this video. This video was a fun idea, and I was enjoying it so far, you know. It was pretty fun, you know, giving the areas points. Until this stupid area, which currently has negative 1 million points. points. So that means that the best location is one of these two rock locations. They were both tied at the end. So these are the two one school locations you should go exploring. I can't believe that just happened. I was about to loot a ritual circle. How did three berries make me want to bomb? Three berries. I hadn't even eaten berries in like 30 seconds. My, uh, this game. I love it to death, but like, why do you have to be to, like this to me sometimes? I know I make really stupid decisions a lot of times. But, like, just let me loot the ritual circle. It was a ritual circle. That's my whole thing. And you took that away from me. Go screw yourself. Also, remember to stay alive and all that garbage. I don't, I don't care at this point, alright? I don't care. 